So, I recall this circulating in my thoughts and wonderings of why it circled into my thoughts and wonderings. As I recall when I was young, I had to walk around a temple with a candle. It was it was called Wian Tian. Wian means similar to a circle of, um, if we're talking about US American terms, it is Wien is in similar to Wien as in the roundabout, Wong Wien, which is what a roundabout is called. So it should be similar to a cycle of karma yeah, when you walk around a temple, like the temple place that beams up around it in a circle, not motion, but in a circle pathway. So to cycle the cycle of karma, most likely it is similar to cleansing the bad in the cycle of karma. So when we're looking at the lights of the candle, it is symbolically to cleanse, yeah? So when they enact this enactment, often in the Buddhism areas, a season of the year, which I believe lasts about one week so in this cycle and season it must be that for the participants it cleanses out the bad and brings you to where you are supposed to be however in this type of action as i did notice i did somehow keep going back in the same pattern and are the same person to see something that I sh should have seen in terms of the path and the enactments of what was going on and what had gone on. So I had noticed that in my memories and in this type of enactment that I have gone back to Darth around year 2000 at his very home. And what I had seen was that it looked like the atmosphere, the place, the time, the home was actually somewhere else. So when resulting and comparing to realities and where one and or many were, it almost as seemed that he and I may have been in two different realities as in terms of he might have seen something else and I have, might have seen something else. So from my recollection and memory he wanted to ask is something going on in my head? And my own self I wanted to figure it out by myself because I do recall something with a key in my head about someone else. However, the constant cycle of, of this type of enactment and not really celebration, but a religious enactment, similar, it is a ritual, a religious ritual in Buddhism. And it seemingly seems that I go back to him and no one else. So when we're looking at even if we're looking at the celebration of God from the dead, which is the actual celebration of day of the dead to pass with thy loved ones, then even still, yeah, and even still the enactment that was acted upon and the two entities was me and him. So it is slightly strange, yeah, like when looking at all this religious stuff that is actually known and is actually practiced throughout the planet, yeah, that there must be some sort of lingering signs to citizens and many lives that it is 
real, yeah. Including magical statues and so on. So, when we're talking about the obvious, yeah, is that it's at a point of not coming back, yeah? So, why was I baptized, to be exact? To create and make a life summary for myself to pray up there to the top of the sky to ask for some guy that I never asked, yeah? And why was that? So, let's say this, like, beginning of this life, yeah, on this very planet Earth, did anyone know who anyone was? Or do people just know people for how much money they have or how much fame they had? So, all honesty is, like, no one knows who anyone is, right? So I can say that I'm like human, I'm homeless, I'm this, I'm that, yeah. And like the moment like I speak the truth about like these religious stuff or like these type of enactments, you're going to say that I'm just human and poor and this and that and I want something from someone, yeah. And you're going to like disrespect me, dig my head and do whatever, yeah, and judge me for my actions and what I went through and who I was with, yeah. So, why? So, the greatest that I could get is who I'm with, yeah. Of King Vampire, yeah. Okay, so, I believe it, yeah. It's the only person that stayed, yeah. But never mind, yeah. I go to church and pray that I want him forever and I want to leave with him. And why was that some sort of issue? It was an issue because of what? Because Balthazar is known to be saying Balthazar from Jane, yeah? Which is kind of funny, yeah? The moment, like, I say he's King Balthazar, it's a big deal for everyone else, yeah? The moment I say, like, birds, Darth Vader, everyone wants to fuck him, yeah? Quite sad, yeah? The moment I say Jacob's special, everybody wants him, yeah? So I can say, like, no one at all, like, a dead piece of planet special, and you'll want to fuck it, yeah? Why is that? So, if someone's gonna say the magical powers of these supposed known powers are artificial and fake, then what is real? So, should we refer back to the very beginning book in Israel that had the Ten Commandments that meant something? So, what is real? If none of the powers or magical stuff works and or is real, then what is? Is reality real? Is life real? Existence real? Is anything real? Anyways, as I came across all these type of objects and things, somehow, yeah, even the statue that I decided to purchase from Amazon, from a section of God from the Dead, it obviously has some relations to me. The reason why I picked it was because upon one night with Balthazar around my pregnancy and or after my pregnancy, I was sleeping and I pulled out a pillow sheet thinking that I was going to do laundry. And Balthazar came here saying, oh, I like this, that guy, and then I don't know where Balthazar purchased the fish hat and somehow I just found that very statue 
In the supposed we intent and cycle of living lives and karma, somehow I found myself at Bird's house, an old house before the one I met him. Is it the current house? I don't know. Is my memory messed up? I don't know. Yeah. But somehow, yeah, I had sexual relations with him in that position, yeah, as a statue. So you're telling me that I am Rosa, Rose Jane, that marries Zach John, and who else? So every life, never mind, yeah, Dart's married, so I have to, like, suck it up and wed someone else, yeah. Is that what it is? In every life, like, I kiss him first, but he fucks with someone else and then, yeah. So this karma cycle just goes around like that, yeah. Because this, that person belongs to this, that person instead, yeah. There's, like, zero factual evidence. Zero. Never mind, yeah. It's love and promise, yeah. We can have sex and have a kid, yeah. Or a kid come out a dog, yeah. So, total summary is this very animal is an Australian Shepherd and Darth Vader used to live in Australia. And as USA citizen is the woman generally gets the kid. So, this is a kid we had one life, yeah? Because we didn't make it to have a child. So, with rights and everything else, by law, I get the child, yeah? So, you can forget about stealing Jacob on a daily basis to your new wife and our family and who the fuck ever, yeah? You just quit now, yeah? And this is a drawing that I had drew for the front of my home door. So when I leave, it is cleansed and a better setting and better place where I should be at all times when I leave my home. <laughs>